previous peek inside the cabinet, we talked about mollusk. And one type of mollusk were gastropods or snails. So in this video, I want to share a little bit more about the diversity of shells that you can find in gastropods and a little bit more about snails. Thing many snails have in common are their shells have spiral shapes. These may be long that extend upwards or they may go around in a flatter form. You can even see these spirals in these fossilized gastropods from long ago. Not all shells that have a spiral are snails though. For example, this fossil ammonite, while a mollusk, was more closely related to the cephalopods. An adaptation that some gastropod shells have are having a number of pointy projections coming off the shell. This adds a layer of protection for these animals beyond just their hard shells because a predator is not going to want to chew on sharp, spiky bits. Snails live in wet environments and need to keep moisture inside their shell. Many snails have a little door called an operculum they can use to close their shells to keep it wet inside. Snails can eat a variety of things depending on the species. Some are herbivores and will eat algae or plants. Other snails are carnivores and will drill holes into other animals' shells to get to them to eat. Both herbivore and carnivorous snails have a special tongue called a radula, which looks kind of like a file. They can use this to scrape up bits of plants, or in the case of the carnivorous snails, drill a hole into shells to get to the animal inside. Slugs are related to snails, but lack the external shell. What they have left for their shell is a little part on top of them called the mantle. Here we see a banana slug grazing in the redwood forest. And we can see its eye stalks. When it senses danger, it can withdraw those eye stalks inside to protect them, like we see here. Banana slugs move on a trail of slime and help decompose things on the forest floor. Join us for next month's A Peek Inside the Cabinet, where we explore amber. Happy science exploring! I'd like to thank everyone for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.